Everybody like stand by, we'll do that same thing again. So Jim, how'd you end up here on set today? Oh, we are recording. Yeah. But it's a camera. What do I know? I don't even know that kind in there. That's not right. You could be your phone, right? Mm-hmm. It's amazing. What did you say? <laughs> what are you... How did you end up on set today? How did you come to be in the movie today? Oh, how did I... Because I was going to say we took a cab. But no... Uh, uh, and they oh, said Vanessa right for me. But uh, no, because uh, they called me this morning and said I'd be decorative. <laughs> Little did they know. No, he called this morning and I told him I couldn't because I'm too poor and don't have any clothes to wear. I have two shirts and one pair of pants. He said, no, I have to wear a jacket because it's a wedding suit. Well, so then we went to Salvation Army and bought this snazzy thing. Very difficult because they don't have any jackets anymore this big. I had to go to the elephant section. <laughs> they used to, that they spiffed the place up. It's all redecorated and fancy now and called the family store. And because back in the day, that's all they had was fat man's clothes. <laughs> when I was thin, I couldn't find anything. Now I'm fat, I can't find anything. <laughs> what good is it? <laughs> Isn't that always the way? So what else? <laughs> so, uh, what were you doing today on set? Well, actually I was masturbating, but I, <laughs> I thought I covered it well. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear about the, the judge who was, you know those pumps they have for the Yeah. Pump? He was pumping under the desk while <laughs> he was hearing testimony in the courtroom. And they all knew, or the people around him knew, and they knew he was doing fun, something funny under the desk. Can you imagine someone, they make noise, you know. Or maybe he had to kind of do a <laughs> But what is it, every now and then he was going. <laughs> it's too funny, under his robes he had this great glass tube with his private set it. Getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> but he had to ask for a new desk. <laughs> I don't know. We were sitting, we were the wedding, yes. And uh, did you enjoy doing Actually, it today? Actually, I did remember the wedding on tour years ago. <laughs> <laughs> I was a guest, yeah. And um, did you enjoy being on set today? Did you like seeing John Lithgow and Alfred Molina? Cheyenne Jackson. Tell me about Cheyenne Jackson. He sings to look like that. Can you imagine being his honey? And he could sing to you every night. Oh, wow. He's got a great Broadway voice, you know. He's terrific, and he's so cute. <laughs> Did you guys get to talk at all? No, I wouldn't even dare. First of all, I'd faint. <laughs> he's really something, you know. Yeah. How, you know, anybody can sing. Boy, that's, you... that's all it takes. You were also in Keep the Lights On. And, uh, yeah, but they got over it. <laughs> <laughs> I have no teeth, you know. Yeah. Well, was this a more fun experience than being in Keep the Lights On? Right there. Is that a... Is there something to compare? <laughs> it was wonderful fun. Let me know. I, don't, I like it all. It's nice. Well, some dance, what? You, you know, who we'll else do. would drag some old what? thing like me out? We'll stick me in a movie. I mean, truthfully, Iris is a very sweet and wonderful man that pays any attention to me. You know? It's very nice of him. It's a kindness, you know. Because, you know, not everybody gets to be in a movie, even if you're bad people. And I was in the foreground for a minute or two in that other movie. That was the best suit made by mankind. Okay. And is the cab here yet? <laughs> She's going to fade right on the screen you know, any minute. I've got the big fat ankles now. I'll never get in the high heels tonight to do the stairs, you know. Yeah. Three shows a night I come down them stairs. 
And with the old lady ankles, forget about it. I can't even get the strap around me. It's terribly painful. <laughs> Are we done yet? Yeah.